This video is sponsored by EP Cube. We're beginning to see a major shift from fossil fuels to cleaner energy sources, which makes solar power a great option for your home. With policies like net metering 3.0, which was launched in California, there's less of an incentive to use solar panels by themselves. EP Cube looks to solve this issue with a battery backup for solar energy. With policies like Net Meter 3.0 in California and similar policies nationwide, there is less incentive to return your power back to the grid. Enium 3.0 ultimately reduced the export rate for residential solar electricity by about 75% and there are policies that are even worse, like in the state where I live, where you're actually charged a fee for returning electricity back to the grid. So having the backup system from EP Cube to hold on to that electricity is definitely going to save you in the long run. Another thing that I thought that was really cool are the cost saving abilities of EP Cube. The EP Cube hybrid inverter allows up to 16 amps per PV string current and sports up to four MPPT connections, enabling greater PV panel connectivity to help you convert more solar energy into electricity for energy storage. It can also help you to store electricity from the grid when prices are lower, helping to reduce your overall energy costs. Becoming more eco-friendly, and doing less damage to the environment is definitely a great reason to switch to solar. There are also other problems that solar resolves. So for me personally, I can remember in 2004 when Hurricane Ivan hit and we were without power for over a month. At the time, we didn't have solar power and we were totally reliant on the power grid. We had to rely totally on ice chests and MRE deliveries and things like that because there was just no power for a very long period of time. At the time, Hurricane Ivan delivered more than $24 billion in damages and it seemed like the city where I was in Pensacola was one of the most affected places. Our own power company wasn't able to restore power on their own. We actually had to wait for other power companies to travel to our area to restore energy. If we had had solar panels with a good battery backup, we would have been able to get through that month um, with energy and it just would have been so much more comfortable for our family. I still live on the Gulf Coast and hurricanes are a threat every single year, which is why my family is looking at solar options as a backup solution to the traditional power grid. Solar panels provide great power during the day when the sun is out, but if there's cloud coverage or when night hits, you're gonna lose all of your power unless you have a good backup solution. You never know when a hurricane may hit or when a rolling blackout may occur, so having that stored energy can definitely be beneficial. EP Cube has several different options depending on the size of space that you have and your current needs. You really don't need a ton of space for EP Cube. At its thickest, it's only 9.25 inches, and at its thinnest, it's only 6.25 inches. EP Cube features an all in one design and integrates a hybrid inverter with storage modules putting communication cables and wires together with a quick connector to stack modules directly, which means that you're gonna need less time for installation, less room for installation, and installation costs are lower. EP Cube uses LifePo4 batteries, meaning you're gonna get thousands of charge cycles out of this backup solution. After 10 years of use, you'll still have 80% capacity on these batteries, which is great because this is warranted for 10 years. EP Cube has a stackable design so you can easily add modules to fit your needs. You can choose between a 9.9 .9 kilowatt hour all the way up to a 19.9 kilowatt hour unit for your system. With the ability to connect up to six groups of enlarged units in parallel, you'll be able to power up your entire home for up to a full week with the stored power. With the power guarantee, EP Cube actually detects oncoming power outages, keeping all of your appliances and electronics running smoothly, even if the grid loses power. EP Cube is compatible with a wide range of devices. Chances are it will be compatible with your current system. It's compatible with most existing PV systems, generators, solar inverters, and even EV chargers, making it universal for wider applications. And I really like the fact that you can manage this smartly and remotely through the application on your cell phone. You can monitor in real time the amount 
of energy that's coming into your battery banks and even the amount of time that it would take to fully charge your power banks, the amount of watts that's coming in from the solar power. You're able to access all of that information from the smart app on your phone. I'll be sure to include links in the description of where you can find out more information on EP Cube and also the Treatum program. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.